this way another question number first and this question as belong to this average app average and the students all the average all the question of average we can solve by the one method that is allegation method in allegation method the whole part is divided between two parts uh, the part first we write here part second or we can say uh, the average of first part the average of second part and the total average the whole part uh, the first part quantity the second part quantity here students uh, uh, the whole part is divided between two uh, first is uh, section uh, b plus a and section a and the total section a plus b plus c section uh, b plus c the average of section b plus c that is given 87.5 and the section a average is 70 and the uh, total average is 84 now in allegation method uh, uh, first divided by second so we write here 87.5 minus 84 that is 3.5 84 minus 70 that is 14 this is ratio this is not the quantity that is 1 and 4 now by this we can say the section in section a the number of student is 1 and the number of student in section b and c is 4 the total number of student in the in uh, in, in all the three section is uh, according to us is 5 4 plus 1 5 but in according to question the, the total number of students is 100 the formula is according to question according to our result according to question the number of student is 100 and the our result by our result the number of student is total 5 100 upon 5 that is 20 to multiply by this by 20 that is 80 multiply by 20 that is 20 so in section a the number of student is 20 so answer is section option c is the right answer the students again the question of average uh, the question you have seen in the screen and the method of uh, the question of this is this and in the video you are seeing on the screen uh, now the student you have seen uh, that uh, the solution of this question is uh, take very long time and that's not good for as far as an example is saying look at our method as i told you that uh, all the questions of average is can be solved by the word method and that is allegation method so look at the again boys girls and total boys average girls average and the total whole the class average the boys average is 60 and the girls average is 80 and the total average of all the classes is 68 68 minus 60 that is 8 80 minus 68 that is 12 now minimize this 2 and 3 now we can say the number of boys in the class is 3 and the number of girls is 2 uh, so according to us uh, the total number of uh, students in the class is 5 but in the in the in and uh, but in the according to the question the total number of students in the class that is not given it doesn't matter because the question is uh, the question is what is the percentage of boys in the class the percentage of boys is 3 divided by 5 because the total number of student is 5 and in that 3 is the boys the percentage of boys is 3 divided by 5 into 100 that is 60 percent so answer is student option B is the right answer.